All right, switching and uh, back to the region where the West Indies were 105 for five off uh, after 22 overs in search of 188 for victory in the second one-day international against Australia at the Kensington Oval in Barbados. Earlier, the Windies dismissed the Australians for 187 of 47.1 overs as Wes Agar top scored with 41. Adam Zampa and Matthew Wade made 36 each. Akil Hussain took 3 for 30 and Alzara Joseph 3 for 39 for the Windies. Uh, of course, the Caribbean side trails 1-0 uh, uh, in the three-match series. The series will end on Monday after being extended following the second ODI being suspended on Thursday due to a positive COVID-19 case. Now, former West Indies captain Darren Sammy uh, is expected to bring a different perspective to Cricket West Indies uh, board, according to Vice President Dr. Kishore Shallow. The St. Lucian was recently appointed as a member of the board after recently being confirmed as an independent non-member director. The president, um, he believed that, you know, we wanted someone, um, a young um, legend, um, Darren Sami has won two World Cups, um, to 20 World Cups for, for West Indies. Um, he understands the modern game. He has been around the world. And so we wanted to have someone like that at the table in the discussion to, you know, be more cricket, cricket focus, right, in our deliberations. And, and he identified Darren along with um, the other directors who endorse it and say, well, you know, he would, he would certainly bring value to the table. Dr. Shallow also distanced himself from suggestions that Sammy's appointment stemmed from the St. Lucian's support of President Ricky Skerritt. I didn't even realize Darren supported us in the campaign. <laughs> Well, Sammy is one of three directors that will serve for the next uh, two years. Trinidadian attorney Mrs. Deborah Corriette Patton and Jamaican surgeon and university administrator Dr. Akshayman Singh were both reappointed to serve a second term.